The day is day 15 and this is the first time we've decided to sleep in the car. Everything outside is pretty wet. There are already some spots where there's a little bit of flooding going on. Looks like it's just rain, rain, rain for days. I don't mind the rain, I just wish it would stop for a little while so we could do things while it's not raining. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> We're gonna go meet my buddy Tommy who lives in Portland and he's gonna let us stay there for a couple days. I am Tommy Day, trained as a physician but have recently mutinied and started my own film and photography business. I can do it! Yeah, so we're in Rooster Rock State Park and we just went down to the beach where a bunch of people are windsurfing and kite surfing. So I was practicing medicine for about 10 years and I hated it. I hated it. I felt like my soul was dying. One night I was laying in bed with Madeline and I said, I feel like this job is killing me. I feel like I should quit and pursue this other thing. And she said, do it. One of the real game changers for me was a workshop called the Adventure Filmmaking Workshop through the Banff Center. It coincides with the Banff Mountain Film Festival. When I met that group of 25 or so people and the instructors, it just blew my mind. I mean, I was like, this is where I need to be. This is what I want to do. A year later, I decided I'd had such a good experience at the filmmaking workshop, why don't I go and do a wilderness photography workshop at the BAM Center? I met someone there who turned me on to one of his buddies who was a professional climbing photographer. And as soon as I met that guy, I was like, we should tell your story. So I spent the next year making a film about him. Submitted that to the Banff Mountain Film Festival and it was accepted. When you're a physician, you're swimming upstream for one person at a time. As a filmmaker, I have the ability, hopefully, to inspire hundreds or more of people in a way that's good for them. If you follow your passion, people are inspired by that. And so now, I'm going back to Banff as an actual filmmaker. And that, to me, is a huge progression and giant step in my career to go to a place that I have always held in high regard. It's still super cloudy and occasionally rains, but as you can see, like with all the light coming in through the window here, about 10 minutes ago that sun just popped out. We're hoping that we're going to bring the sun along with us. We might have less rain because that would be cool. And sleeping in the car wasn't so bad and sleeping in the car once in two weeks was not bad at all.